Okay. We have our dresser, right? Or our storage organizer one right in. sweetie fam welcome back to my channel i am vivid Petra denise produced by zenny productions and your favorite plus size stylist is back with a review and i'm super excited about it but before we get into the review go down to the subscribe button click the bell so you can be notified because i do drop a video every tuesday and thursday at 4 p.m and on this channel i talk about family fashion and lifestyle because this is the place to be for all of that it is spring we are decluttering we are upgrading y'all got them taxes have been low and now you want to do some things to your home so I want you to know that you can definitely get some things for your home inexpensively okay and what I mean by that is I did go to a, a furniture store to see what my options were and I'm gonna be honest I wasn't impressed I was not impressed also with the increase of wood and labor it was actually really expensive just to get a four to five drawer dresser that was just way too much money and it exceeded my budget so I was like okay let me find an inexpensive item that I could use in my studio that I like that would match the aesthetic and obviously be inexpensive so we're gonna get right into it first and foremost I needed a dresser because right here which I'll show you I had a I guess you want to call it a like shelf and I had the cloth style crates okay something you could fold up if you weren't using anymore however no uh-uh not at all so I get on good Amazona okay definitely think Amazon is a woman and I found something that not only matched my aesthetic in my studio something I actually like because on personal variety I like a lot of things and it has to be eye-catching for me and thirdly that was inexpensive okay so I went with the brand called warm and love it was the warm and love store on Amazon and this is what the box looked like so this is the style of the dresser it has 10 drawers I got the brown one that matches the aesthetic in my office my vanity and the desk that I all got last year which I will put the videos to those um, two items that I reviewed and I showed you like how I decorated my office and things like that I'll put those right here now, here's the thing this area is is transitioning from my office my studio to a glam room full glam this is the first step so let's get into how long it took it took me or should I say it would have taken me about an hour and 15 minutes only because I did put the middle piece on wrong the first time so it took me like 15 minutes to take to to take pretty much the whole thing apart and then turn uh, fix it the right way and then so that was like an extra 15 minutes outside of that it took me about an hour because I really wasn't in a rush didn't have anywhere to go I did have to take a a, a food break however that was longer than I expected to be so if I wanted to just put all the you know how long it took me together it took me about an hour if I didn't turn um, have the piece in the middle wrong and if I didn't have to take a food break so it took me an hour which I don't think is too bad you guys saw the box that it came in the box was in great condition everything that was needed on the instructions was available in the box so no missing pieces no dented pieces no uh, smells none of that which y'all know I'm, I'm all about presentation okay and I'm not gonna review anything with you guys if I feel a certain way about it like if it stinks yeah I'm gonna let y'all know if it came busted and disgusted yeah I'm gonna let you know if they manhandle my things with Amazon I'm going to let you know. But none of those things apply to me. So shout out to Amazon and the Warm and Love store. I will have the link for this particular dresser below. Now, I'm going to be completely honest. The only thing that I would say about this dresser is I wish it was about an inch and a half wider on each side of the drawer. So as you can see the drawer here, so it was about an inch and a half here and an inch and a half here you know from this one dresser or this one drawer that would just make it a little bit bigger and then 
um, the drawers would be a little bit longer, as in uh, top to bottom. That's about it. However, I purchased this dresser uh, in the amount of about $70, so it was like $69.99. Now, the coolest thing about this dresser, which is one of the reasons why I was like, I gotta have this dresser, is the organizers that were built in, okay? And I did a video about organizers for your undergarments, ties, socks, tights, um, the list goes on and I'll put that video right here it was my Jane is my favorite item for January and I literally swear by those organizers okay and I have five of them three for socks two for undergarments and this dresser already has it look at that it already has it okay look at that it has four dresser or it has four drawers excuse me that has the organizers in it and I was like yes yes I choose that I no longer want to use the organizer it's as simple as a velcro detachment yeah 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 y'all saw that so it's easy as one two three I can get rid of the organizers and not even have to worry about it look at that four organizers now these drawers with the organiz organizer in them are smaller than the empty drawers or should I say just the drawers that do not have the organizers in there but they're definitely really good size and it is six of these drawers that do not have the organizers in them very easy to pull in and out I do want to say this when I built my vanity there's three drawers well, actually it's four drawers and the three drawers that are directly on top of each other you had to put in the track you like you know all that and the bottom one I'm, I don't know if I did it wrong I don't know if they didn't make the piece well enough but it's kind of hard to come out hard to go in with that being said I was hoping that this didn't have um, the same thing like I had to put the track in so the drawer can roll on the track that's how you pull it out and in. This one, you pull this out on your own. Look at that. You see how I could just put this in? You see how I could just take it out? There's no track. I really like that. I'm going to be completely honest with y'all. I really like that. I think that that's probably one of my favorite parts outside of the organizers. Definitely. So easy, so simple. I also um, want to say this is not heavy at all. So I would... I would suggest that you are particular what you put in here because you don't want it falling forward because it's so heavy. Now they did give me options where I could nail it to the wall. However, this is my glam room and we won't be nailing nothing to the wall unless it's the cool. I will rate this a 10 out of 10 on presentation, the way it came, the box, and um, all of the pieces being a part of the instructions I would give this dress or 10 out of 10 so far on these things presentation that means the way it came in the box the box was packaged no dents in the box because I feel like when you have this in the box the possibility your your product could have dents number two is the instructions and all the pieces with the instructions they were hand in hand they went right together number three which is where I was I able to understand the instructions to get the job done very easy very simple clear instructions they did have words but, they, but the pictures actually were really really good so I love that and last but totally not least is the time it took it took about it would have took me about an hour but I told y'all I put them in apart the in there um, backwards and then I had to take a food break. So ultimately, just of those things, I definitely would suggest this. If you have a glam room, I'm going for a darker look and feel for my glam room furniture. So that's why I stuck with the brown and the black, which is the same color as my vanity, which is the same color as my desk. That's why I kept with that because my walls are teal and my husband kind of suggested, like, what if you paint the walls? And I was like, I actually like the pop of color. A lot of times when I see fashionistas and creators, it's all neutral or really, really light gray. And then all the furniture is neutral and all that. And I, lo I love color. I, I love color. So I like that my walls are teal and that the dark furniture pops off of the wall. The girls that get it. 
get it and that's on period so I do want to say this though I would definitely get this for children I would get it for a teenager if you have a college student who has moved to their apartment and they need furniture doesn't come furnished this would do two of these that would be about $140 on, on furniture would be great you can also set a TV up here and if you put two next to each other up against the wall you can have your TV on it like like a 60 70 inch TV 10 out of 10 I definitely recommend don't forget the link will be in the description for this dresser also if you enter crafting I think this would be a good dresser as well so yeah yeah Absolutely. Y'all, I have a Denise. And y'all be sweet. Smooches.